Hi guys, I am Isa, and today we're going to be learning how to make sign up and login form in HTML. At least login and sign up form in HTML. So the first thing I'm going to do is make this tag. It's going to say how to make okay how to code login and Log in and sign up for in HTML. So the first thing I'm going to do is do the doc type HTML. HTML and then head and the body. Actually, I'm going to do the title first. So the head title. Form, form. So now we have this title over here. Good. So now we can make the body. So in this body, the first thing I want to do is make a heading, which is going to say fill in the following form so now we have a h1 in our web page so then we want to do a div which means divider so i'm going to do a div id new form now the ids don't do anything but we're gonna get into them in, in later videos so and then div id form so here i'm going to put a label for a fan here i'm going to write first name so now we have this so and then we're going to put two breaks and then put an input so input type text we don't really need any of these names or ids so now we have the first name working so now we're going to do the last name make two breaks okay two breaks and then make another label label for ln last name so then make two breaks again then use the input type text so yeah so i don't need these now we could just copy and paste them so now label for pn it's going to be phone number so phone number and i'm going to change this to from input type text to input type number So there we have it. We have the first name, the so last name, and the phone number. And the phone number can only write numbers. It goes as input type to numbers. And there's also a slider, which you need to increase and decrease numbers. So we're not really gonna need that one on your phone numbers anyways. So now we're going to make the email. So label for EA, I'm going to do email address. Good, so I wrote email address here. I'm going to change this input type from text to email. So now we have the email address working. So now we're going to do the password. So label for PW and here I'm gonna write password password change the input type from text to password so now I'm gonna have working password 
So now we're going to just confirm password. We can pretty much just copy the password and change the text over here to confirm password. We have confirm password. Good to now confirm password. So now you're going to go here and write if and write a paragraph which is going to say if you don't have an account. So then inside of us, we're gonna put a button. And this button is going to say, sign up here. And you're good. So now we have this. Another way you could do it is that you could put the here inside the paragraph here. So now, I'm just going to make two breaks. I got to do with those others. So, and then make another paragraph. So you can put this out there if you want. So, so I'm going to make another paragraph and say if you have an account, then I'm going to make a link. So to make a link, you have to write A and put the href. So first I'm just going to write the text that's going to be inside of it. So I'm going to write log in and then write here. So now I was going to read this. But if we we'll click on it, it's not going to do anything because we haven't gave it a link. So I have this page open here. Like you can use any page you want. So I'm just gonna use this page for an example. So I have to go to the address bar, select the entire link, press Ctrl C or just right click and copy. And then go into VS Code or whatever it is you're using and paste that link into AHREF. Now if I reload it and I click on the login. It's going to open up that page. Now we're going to do the styling. I'm going to style the body. I'm going to style it. Take the background light blue. So now it's like this. It looks better. So we're going to style the form too. Style background. I'm going to do white red okay so i want to do this color so now it's like this so now we're going to do the font size so then font size 20 px so now we have increased font size so noise that's the end of today's video. If you've enjoyed, don't leave a like and subscribe. So, bye.